Hey Falcons, welcome to the College and Career Corner, where we talk about all things related to your post-graduation opportunities. Today, we're going to talk about what to do if you change what you want to pursue for your major or your career. Before we start, let me go ahead and ask you a question. Are you worried that you might change your major or career? Is it a concern that makes picking what you want to do difficult? Before we even go into the reasons people change careers, let's talk about how much it happens. The National Center for Education Statistics reports that nearly 80% of students change their majors. Of the students who change their majors, most of them change an average of three times. Some data even suggests that students who do change their major are at least a little more likely to complete their education. And that's probably because they end up pursuing a major that they're more interested in when they do change. Also too, since the first two-ish years of college is primarily made up of core classes, which are classes that are similar and required for most majors, it's easier to change majors without significant repercussions during that time. Now, when it comes to job and careers, the average person has about 12 different jobs through their lifetime. However, millennials change their careers and jobs more often than older generations, and early data suggests that Gen Z also follows that trend. Work-life balance, flexible scheduling, and a positive culture are among the top reasons people cite for wanting to change their careers. Many people also report a higher salary as a motivation to change jobs or careers as well. All that to say, changing your career or your major or just your career aspirations, it's a common experience for many students and professionals. If you find yourself considering a change in a major or career, here are a couple steps that you can take to help you through that process. First off, reflect on your reasons for wanting to change. Before making any decisions, take some time to reflect. Why do you want to change? Why do you want to change your major, your career goals? Ask yourself what aspects of your current path just aren't meeting your expectations or they're unsatisfying, and what do you hope to gain by changing your course? This reflection can help you make a more informed decision as well as identify some potential challenges you could face in pursuing a new path. Also, talk to a counselor or your academic advisor. If you're a student, you may want to schedule a meeting with your academic advisor or your career counselor. You could also talk to your counselor this at your school now. Usually at colleges, they also have career counselors. You can talk to them as well. All of your counselors, all these people who are here to support you with your career, are here to help you explore different majors, career paths, and provide information about required courses or training, and just answer any questions that you have. You should also research your options. Take some time to research different majors or career fields that interest you. Look at their requirements. Look at the job outlook. Look at the potential salaries. You should also look at how all of that applies in the states or the cities that you want to live in. Also look at the trends. Does it look like there's more need for this job? Or is it kind of being phased out? Is it growing here? Is it declining here? Another thing you should do, just get involved. If you're interested in a new major or career path, start getting involved in related activities or organizations. This can help you gain experience and some insight into the field. It also helps you make connections with people, some professionals, who can offer you some guidance and support. And finally, you should make a plan. If you've identified a new major or career path, let's create a plan for how you're gonna achieve your goals. This can involve taking specific courses, gaining some relevant experience through internships or volunteer work, or just pursuing additional education or training. Again, remember that changing your major or career aspirations is normal. This is actually part of your journey. I've said it before, I'm never gonna ask you what do you wanna do for the rest of your life. I've changed what I've wanted to do a ton of times, a ton of times, but I've had people who've been around me to help give me some guidance, to help me make a good plan. I've followed these tips, right? It can be a challenging process, but with the right support and a clear plan, you can successfully navigate the transition and find a path that aligns with your passions and your goals. So if you got any questions for me, like always, you can book an appointment with me through eClass. Have a great day and go Falcons.